Hey, I'm at Target. It's the first clip of this video, I believe. Um, yeah, they have some G.I. Joe stuff. I don't know why I showed that off, but they have a bunch of the classified series. They're kind of hard to find. Lady Jane. You got Flynn. I don't know if I've seen those guys before. Cobra Commander. Lady Jane. Wow, and Flint. What we got here? Lady Jane. Okay, I think it's all the same up here. That's kind of, you know, different. Um, oh, and you got some new um, multiverse stuff. We got Dark Side. It's pretty cool. Ooh, I like his step at all. I don't really like him as a character, but sculpt wise, he looks really neat. And we got some of this collect collect collecting connect. Wait, are they still called that? Collect the build. Those Batman assisted two characters. And then we got the Doomsday down there. Um, nothing in the Black Series collect in this Black Series aisle. Why am I talking like this? Anyways, the Baron Zenuts. I haven't seen him in a while. And then this utterly smashed box. Um, no LeBron James. Um, water toy things. Really big chain. No new Sonic figure. Why am I even trying? You got some Pokemon cards though. Although I'm kind of broke right now, so I will not be buying any. Hey guys, I saw a lot over here, but I'm at Target picking up a box because I sold a Wii I picked up. Anyways, I have some new stuff here. Uh, no Star Wars Black Series, but we got a model Razor Crest, which is kind of fun. This Mondo Mando, Mondo Model Mandalorian. We got some of the new, uh, I think it's the new Ghostbusters, dude. Oh my god. And we got some of like the older people, I guess, which I feel like is kind of a spoiler. I don't know if we knew if they were in the movie. Um, got some Bugs Bunnies. LeBron heads are intact there. And then this will take a quick look at the Marvel stuff. Anything cool? No Sonic skateboards. Oh, it's clearance. Hold on. Let's see if there's any cool clearance. Oh, not seeing anything too cool. The Ghostbusters dude for $14. Ooh, Lego. I'll have to take a finer. Uh, a detailed look at this after I shut this off because of both of my hands are currently full but uh yeah nothing too cool clearance wise I think there may be some of these like Lego sets that don't have clearance stickers on them but uh yeah let's go wait what's this not something all right cool caught it get wrecked okay this I'm struggling way harder than I should right now. Oh, there's some Marvel stuff. But, uh, oh, there's new stuff here. Alright, I'm gonna put this down. I got a low key. Some of the Infinity War Saga stuff. Odin. Cool. Haven't seen him before. That's 25. And they have a uh, Dark Star, which I don't know if I've seen in a hurry yet. Cool. I think the only one from the I haven't seen is Ultron. Well, I think we should get the really. So I think we should get the small Yeah, that seems like everything of interest here. So I'm gonna cut it and keep looking around. Right here, I'm at another Target. I don't know why I stuttered for a second there. But uh, yeah, they have some new stuff here. One per guest. I've seen that before. Oh, uh, yeah, we got some more Infinity Saga stuff. We got Happy. He's pretty cool. I'm gonna get a Happy Hogan. I like him, even though I'm not collecting Legends as much anymore. Um, he's a cool character. And you have uh, what, Iron Man 21. Yeah, he's alright. He's the coolest one now. And everything else is seemingly the same. You got some Odin's. The big dude's gone from Thor. Uh, what's this? Another Odin. Got some of the uh, Disney Plus wave. So we got Bucky. That's not Bucky though, is it? Someone. Have I never seen Bucky before? He looks off to me. I don't, I'm assuming he's had a repick. There's a part still in there. Uh, we got US Agent and the US 
Hey, John. Got two new Sonic figures. Pretty cool. I want to get that three pack though. And then, yeah, it seems like everything else new here. Got some, uh, those guys. Some generic G.I. Joe. But yeah, it's everything here. Of course, nothing in Star Wars. I don't know what's going on. None of these stores bought me up stock Star Wars figures in like a month. So that's great. Some more money saved for me, I guess. Wow, we come from in Target back to the room with some boxes. Um, these are pretty cool. If you guys saw my last video, uh, I struggled getting the uh, Comic-Con Dragon Ball Con exclusive figure thing they do from Figuarts. Um, as it has been since last year, at least, I'm pretty sure it also seems like every year it's awful experience. Um, these are the hardest thing that I've ever tried to get every year. I sit on the site for five plus hours. It's refreshing and the site keeps crashing, but I got through. Sadly, I had to order them one at a time, the two I wanted, because... They wouldn't let me check out with both of them, but one at a time they would let me, so they got an extra, like, eight bucks out of me for shipping, which is the coolest. But hopefully these figures are worse. I didn't pick up all of the exclusive figures because I didn't need all of them. And one of them was Nappa. I think they're the first one I to pick up. But, uh, yeah. I have a Nappa up there I got for free pretty much when... Uh, Big Bad sent me a broken one of the Sniper Wolf statue, and it's like I could keep the broken one. And I traded some guy locally for the broken one for uh, figure arts. And then I realized this is going to be way harder than I thought it was going to be. So, I'm going to take out the, the box. And then who we got first up in here? We got another box. Fuck, I forgot about this. But, yeah, we got beer is one I'm excited for the most. I'm about to sneeze. Hold on. Allergies kicking in. We got beers. Um, I'm gonna open these up by the end of the video, and I will showcase them a bit more. I think I'll just leave them in the box for now. But yeah, we got beers. And who could the other one be? I could only ever imagine who would go all along with beers in the Dragon Ball Super Show. I have no clue personally, but I have a feeling that it's gotta be Drumroll, please. Yamcha Weiss. Nice. Got Weiss and beers. Super happy to get these figures finally. Um, was not gonna pay the uh, kind of like current mark. I wouldn't say scalpers because they're not scalpers, but you know, what they're going for now in the secondary market because you know they're out of print and stuff. But luckily, they did a Comic Con version of them with a bit of a different, I think, more anime accurate colors. And I think Weiss is mixing, missing like his spoon accessory or something. But yeah, I'm happy. Uh, 50 bucks each. Thank you very much. They're probably going for like 1 or 150 right now. And the regular versions were going for like 200 So uh, I'm glad to get these two together for half the cost. It would have cost for one of them. So yeah, stick around to the end of the video. I've been hankering to open up some uh, Dragon Ball figure arts. And so I will showcase them in the box and what they come with at the end of the video. So very excited. On to the next thing I record. Hey, I'm in a car right now. And there's some new um, McFarland stuff out. In the uh, back and like by the cops and stuff. If you're looking for these, uh, they have the clown from Spawn. He looks pretty cool. I like that. I'm not, I not really read Spawn, but it's fun. And we got some of the uh, Suicide Squad movie wave. Pretty good movie. It's pretty good. I don't know if they're all Harley Quinn, but there's other ones. So we got uh, this Peacemaker. Not bad. Should have came with like a gun. No, I don't know. Way cooler. And we got two blood sports. But sure it's alright. It's definitely the least coolest one out of this. No polka dot man either. Uh, if I ever did find a bit like the Walmart one of him was just all in one for like 30 bucks, I may pick it up. But uh yeah, it seems everything here has some like vintage card stuff. I don't know if any of this is new per se. You know, like keep up with it. And then over here, not too much. It's the Mortal Kombat stuff you got. Crawl or cable, cable, cabal. Yeah, I'm stupid. And yeah, it's really it. So, um, on to the next clip. And there's some V Bucks. Okay, my target. Uh, I wasn't planning on filming here, but they have some new uh, legend stuff. Hey, should they got like some returns? It looks like that means they got a return. With the villain's wave, I haven't really seen much of the villain wave in these parts of the town. So, we got Arcade. When I was collecting Spider Man, I didn't want to pick him up because he's in a probably in a new current Spider Man run. He was in. One of my favorite ones was Craven. 
did a pretty big part. And then we got this really cool Doctor Doom. I love that piece right there. I don't do X-Men. I think Darkstar was here. We got the hood. A bunch of these uh, two packs. And then we got some of the the Bear Wave here. Another hood. And then we got a US Agent. A good mix of stuff. Of course, I already checked the uh, Star Wars section. And there's nothing. Like, always. Because why would there be something I'd want to collect? I think this is new. But, uh, yeah, I want to show those off real quick. There's more Legends over here for some reason. And we got, ooh, Dormar Dormammu. That's pretty fun. Another arcade and a regular Iron Man. And, uh, yeah, I don't think there's anything in DC Multiverse. It's down to 21 bucks. It's a cool bike. And, yeah, I'm going to end it here. And another Iron Man. I got it scattered everywhere. I wanted to uh, do this unboxing of an item I got, but, um... My phone is ringing. But it sounds like it's done. Uh, it sounds like it's done. So I'm going to open it up now. I got another package from SH Figure Arts in this video. Or Bandai Premium. I'm very excited to get this figure. I think it did get delayed. And I believe the next one I'm getting, which would be Lord Cooler, technically, did just get delayed. But I'm very excited to get this one. Oh, it's pretty on the fence, gang. I also remember that I just opened one with another box in here. That's now this box is stuck in here. All right, I'm gonna put it here while you hear me talk. But yeah, I got delayed. There we go. Uh, and that is SHF Hit. Very excited for him. Not top of my radar, but I did want him though. I did like his character in Super. He's a fun character. Got a bunch of different heads. Uh, a couple cool little um, poses you can do. I like the hand one, that's a possibility. I also kind of like this one. That's a fun one. But yeah, I don't know which one I'll do. Uh, I didn't get this one a bit cheaper. I believe I used a free shipping coupon I got with some, one of the figures. I got two free shipping coupons throughout my time using Bandai Premium. One was for Goku, which I used on Cooler, because shipping on Cooler was like 15 bucks of how massive and heavy it's going to be. But this one I did too, because I didn't want to spend full price on it, but I did want it kind of like how I am with Cabo right now. Anyways, yeah. Uh, next clip will probably be what I've opened up recently. I definitely opened up a lot of figures over the past like week and a half because there's been a lot of stuff I've wanted to open. This included, I was waiting to film the end of this video until I got this figure because I did really want to open it and showcase it in the video, which I should probably wait till the next video, but I didn't. So, yeah. Be a man of my word and unbox this later today and film that tomorrow. And while I am a man of my word, I must declare it has probably been... A month and a half since I filmed that. Yeah, I've been gone for a bit, I'll admit it. But guess who's back? This guy's back. But uh, yeah, I've been really busy uh, with some work stuff. I got some freelance jobs I had to kind of do over the past months. That took a lot of time. And then I had school start up. I'm a senior now. I got a, yeah, like a year left. That's crazy. Anyways, I want to show you what I picked up like a month and a half ago. I got this uh, Blitz and Glamour Android 18. She's pretty cool. I got that free comic book day not to date this. And then I got some really cool figure arts, which is probably the main focal point of the video. Man, I had that Goku for probably over a year and I finally opened it. But the other ones I opened right away. And God, I'm so excited to get these bad boys. Look at that Beerus. He's chilling on the ground. He's yawning. Like, well, look how cool he is. I love it. I'm so glad I was able to finally get it. Uh, worst experience of my life trying to get Beerus and uh, Whis, but you know, whatever. Gotta do what you gotta do. And Whis, looking great. Loved the little spoon, loved the little sphere. I didn't think he actually came with the spoon originally, so I'm glad he actually did. That makes me happy. Uh, if they do a new one, I might pick it up, because he can't really pose him too much, obviously, because the skirt, but he's great. And then we got Hit. Really like Hit. I like how they, uh, hope you can't hear the car outside my house. Uh, you can put the hands in his pocket and they kind of mold in there really easily. I, they've done that before with other figures and it went it doesn't really work as well. But this one looks really good, I feel like. So I'm very happy about that. It's just like an interchangeable like skirt piece, if I'm correct. And yeah, that's all the Dragon Ball stuff. Here's some more angles of it. And I put Whis backwards for some reason. And I could not tell you why I did. But gee golly, I did do that. And I opened up a couple Black Series figures recently. I had these for a while, too. This is obviously Archive Wave 3, I believe. And you just have the, you know, uh, what are they called? You got the sh Dark Trooper, Shadow Trooper, and... Oh, fuck, what? Tank Trooper? I don't remember. I still have one more of these to open, I'm pretty sure. 
But, uh, yeah, I like them. They're pretty cool. I'm a fan of them. Not really too many complaints that I can remember, at least. I haven't touched these figures in how long. Couldn't tell you. But, anyways, yeah, it's the video. I'm sorry for the delay. Um, hopefully a couple more videos coming out soon. I do have a couple videos planned. I have one that's already, like, shot. I just have to edit it as well. I've been saying this footage for a while, too. But I'm still going to a Comic-Con in a couple weeks, so expect a video from that. I'm pretty sure that will be a very fun time. Like and subscribe, comment down below what you picked up, and see ya.